This is the TV news for Thursday, February 10th, 2011. Brought to you by NumarU.com, internet marketing education for professional people. Hello, I'm Jeff Grimshaw, and we begin with huge, huge numbers for the big game. No, <laughs> I'm not talking about Super Bowl 45. Once again, I'm talking about Animal Planet's Puppy Bowl 7, which, during its premiere on Super Sunday, along with its five-time repeat marathon, snatched 9.2 million viewers. <laughs> wow. I told you that halftime slinky kitty show was going to draw. Ugh. Congratulations to everyone at Animal Planet for making Super Sunday even more super for TV. Okay, the KO Laden, that's Keith Olbermann Laden, current TV is making a major play for news and reality eyeballs. In their upfront presentation, current TV says they will be America's real deal reality network. Obviously, Olbermann's yet to be titled show, which is slated to bow later this spring, will be the network tentpole. Now, surrounding it will most likely be plenty of both existing and new docu-series. More on current TV as it develops. Hey, you want to see the uh, perniciously talent challenge Kim Kardashian get booted off the stage by Prince? Well, it all happened during a live concert. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Kim, you couldn't even dance? Please, even I can do that. Look, all those Kardashian girls are pushing the envelope of an ever conspicuous dearth of anything resembling talent. Our media PR guru, Arthur Sando, is traveling, so I will ask you this. How many antique, junk, pawn shop shows do you think there are out there on TV? Let me give you a hint. There aren't 17, like with cake shows. But the gap is being closed. Oh, no. Here's our current count to date. Antiques Roadshow on PBS. That's the Genesis program. Flea Market Mania on ALN. Then on history, you've got the uber-popular Pawn Stars and American Pickers. HGTV has Junk Brothers, Cash and Carry, plus Cash in the Attic. A&E is now engaging in Storage Wars. And finally, TLC is developing Pawn Queens. Oh, I forgot. TV Land has Sanford and Son. I got a mindful of junk. Well, that's 10 and counting. And to comment, this TV industry copycatting, just like the parade of cake shows, is getting ridiculous. Please stop. Please stop now. Now this from our sponsor. Could switching to GEICO really save you 15% or more on car insurance? Is a bird in the hand worth two in the bush? Well, you rarely see them in this good a shape. For example, the, the fingers are perfect. The bird is in mint condition. And I'd say if this were to go to auction today conservatively, it would be worth two in the bush. Really? It's just beautiful. Thank you so much for bringing it in. Unbelievable. At GEICO, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more. Future events and opportunities. Brought to you by Sando Communications. Sound judgment, solid credibility, and superior results. This is Sando Communications. What are you, living under a rock? You've got to know that the TV news is approaching 300,000 views by top TV and new media pros. Check out our clout scores. Yeah, they measure our mega influence in social media within the industry. It's awesome. Become a big deal sponsor of the TV News. Ping us with an email at advertise at the TV news TV. And that about does it for this edition of the TV News. We will be back tomorrow with a fresh edition. Eric Mackerlin will be in to create an alternate sports universe. It does not include NFL football. <laughs> That's not too scary. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. We thank you very much for watching. And as always, 
Go out and make it a good day. The TV News has been brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative challenges, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution.